Aba Kristu kwa kelezi ya senti bali kudembe sangi wa mchuwanga parish mudayo sensa ya alu gazi Baka dekwe wa kwa kelezi ya wakusobolo kuba unga bajuli zinga banabu kuba mkwa ya St. Mary's Baku bebi la ilo bia webi wa bufumbo butukovu Okusawa kuno kutandise kusawa mukage zo mutuntu yona ku ralero nga ukulembedwa Bishop Emeritus Mafia Sekamanya eranga abagole ba mirundi ena be bagattiddwa Mukuyigiriza Bishop Sekamanya sabya abagole bano buli jjo kubanga abagumikiriza mu bufumbo wawe batandise olina ku ralero buli omwo kutegera munne okubeeranga aba mazima awamu nokwesiganga abagara babwe not easily lived. It demands patience, sympathy, forgiving, without revenge, without envy, without suspicion. Whether you like it, like it or not, the husband may talk to other people. So would also the wife. But not, not every time you speak to the lady, but you conclude that he now is making another thing, another love. The same thing with especially men. Men are a bit more envious. He ain't got a use and know you. You are laughing so much with that. But what, what, what is your relationship? Mutual trust. You have made your decision. You need to trust one another. Man is human, is a social being. He cannot be with you all the time. Talk with you all only. Trust one another. And also, you married men who are getting married, show that really you are trustworthy of your partner, the way you relate with others, and also the way you relate with him. I think if this is so, then marriage will be very happy. Then will be a difference between now and the previous year. Onera kuti daba gala naba no, awamu naba bafu mbili ganwe da, ohunga bananga naba gara babwe, kusano kutambula angamu naba antu babwe, chiba soboze suwa kwe walevi kemo, evi inzo kuleta wenja ukana mufu mbo babwe. I am my partner, and I promise you all him to be together for life. That is dangerous, I better run away. So don't look so bad. Don't enjoy the talk, even if it's so sweet. Maybe gradually we will go. We will sleep. Avoid occasions which can lead you to that. Either way, now men today, very good job. And after that, we have a fellow men. Let us go to drink. Ah, we are very tired. Let us go. You go. But also there are ladies today who get money. They have house girls. So they don't have to, 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 to hurry. And you find there another lady, beautiful. And when you compare this one with your wife, you say, ah, I wish I had seen this. But it's too late. It's too late. Stick to that one. In Uganda, we say, Now you will get the food. But please don't overeat. Because we are celebrating. No, it's reasonable as a gentle person. The same thing with these opposite sex you see in your offices, in racing places, the still the bus. Yeah, you are your company. So with that. And consequently, you marry them who are going to, who are getting married in the church. Use occasion to go out together. Sit together. They are together to help your partner who will be tempted to say, my partner is at home. If he say, hello, where do you work? What did you do? Where do you sit? And then you go slowly, not overnight. You may take time because you do the similar bars, the same bars now in the day, a few different places. These are the challenges you are facing. And a good number of you are all of you are welcome to the Yahweh. I want to never hear you say more from Bobo to Kovu. I Patrick Ochen.
take thee Mary Ariacot to be my lawful wedded wife, to have and to hold for poor in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish till death do us part. to be my lawful wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health. <laughs> to love and to cherish till death do has parts. Of these couples, I confirm their marriage vows in the name of the Father, and of the Son, what God has put together, let no man put asunder. Now you are married forever till death.